What's up, everyone? Welcome. We're going to start playing the Angry Video Game Nerd game in just a moment. But my first drink of the day for the Christmas Marathon is Silver City Brewery Old Scrooge Ale, which is a, it says a dark malty ale with notes of apple, cherry, and apricot. Okay. Um, today, over the course of today, I will be drinking a lot. Various beer. I have five different beers I bought, plus eggnog and maybe something special later. But anyway... Uh, most, I, I would assume a lot of the beer I'm going to drink today is from more local places. I went to a local liquor store, and they usually stock a lot of, like, local brewery stuff. Out here in Washington and Oregon, it's huge. I don't know why, but beer making is like a giant pastime out here. There's a million breweries and everything. So, this is the first one for today. I'm going to give it a sip here. We're going to see what it's like. Ready? Smells, eh. No, I don't really smell too much fruity notes to it. It smells more just like regular beer to me. But, alright. Anyway, let's give it a shot. Mmm. I mean, I'll be honest, I don't really taste any fruit. But, it's a good dark, dark, malty ale. Just like they say. I like malt flavor. Especially in a beer. I haven't had a beer like this in a long time. Pretty good. I like that. Okay. That's good stuff. Um, okay, hold on a second. Because Black Mage C-Type did a 250-bit cheer. He said, Merry Christmas Marathon Phil. I was actually working on a funny gift for your streams of Tim Curry taking away Kevin's stolen credit card from Home Alone 2, but unfortunately I lacked the time or skill to make it, so I had to abandon it. I'm sorry to hear that. That would have been pretty funny, actually, considering the amount of tip auditing that I need to do these days because of uh, troll activity. And you guys know. So here's the thing. Doing it on PC is easy. I'm right here. I can easily just type it in, tip audit, boom, done. When I'm on the uh, over there, uh, you know, in my setup over there for console gaming, it's a lot more difficult to do. Um, that would have been funny though. I mean, Tim, oh, we gotta do a tip audit and you play the Tim Curry gif auditing the stole it credit card. That would have been neat. Thank you at least for thinking about it, Black Mace C-Type. That would have been cool. Um, all right. So ladies and gentlemen, speaking of tip audits, I just received a $200 tip from Murdoch and it's legit. He says, happy Christmas to you and Kat. Do Americans have the custom of eating a goose for Christmas? If so, have one on me. Um, a long time ago, I, I heard reference to the Christmas goose. Um... I personally have never had goose. I don't know if it tastes good or not, or if I would like it, because uh, I like duck. I love duck. Turkey's okay, in my opinion. I've had, I've had Cornish game hens. Those are pretty good, but I've never had a Christmas goose. Uh, but thank you very much, Murdoch. $200 tip. Much appreciated. Thank you, thank you so much. Um, before we even played a single game, pretty awesome, right? Timbo Slice just cheered. He said, I'm a big craft beer person. Oregon has the most brewers in one radius area in the country. The Northwest is some of the best craft beer in the world. I know. That's why I said, like, the local brew out here is usually quite good. It's good, man. It tastes really good. Richie Seven says it's 8.5%. It is. 8.5% alcoholic. It's a little bit higher alcoholic content, right, than standard beer. It's good stuff, man. Um, so Spartan King just cheered. He said, Derek is here. And says, happy holidays, Phil. I'm looking forward to today's festive Christmas marathon. You get any Canadian beers? I think you said you really liked it during one of the holiday marathons. I don't know. I actually don't know. I just bought, I got five from my local liquor store that looked good. And I'll tell you today as I drink them what they are. But I don't know where they're from. This, this one is from Washington. It's Bremerton, Washington. Papa Vera is here. Welcome back, back, Papa Vera. Papa Vera, you may not realize this, but you became such a big part of my streams for Minecraft that people were wondering where you were for the months you weren't here. And not, it's good to see you back here. Happy holidays to you, sir. He cheered and he said, I recommend for anyone, it's called Triple Exultation, a barley wine by Eel River Brewing Company. I call it Thor beer because it has the Mjolnir on the label. You mean Mjolnir, the hammer. That's correct. Cool. It's good to see you. Will be Atomic just did a 200-bit cheer. He said, I can see Murdoch looking after that spot for me. There you go. Murdoch, the top... Do you really think anyone's going to top $200 today? Let's be honest today. <laughs> I don't expect it. I'm greatly appreciative if it happens, but I don't expect it. Okay. Um, so, let's get this game working, shall we? Um, actually, let me get the gamepad first. Because I need to get that plus the USB cable. Then we'll get the game working. And yes, I'm purposely wearing my Zelda pants today. Why? Because people tend to, to make comments about the Zelda pants when I wear them. So I'm wearing them on purpose today. 
So there you go. Enjoy the Zelda pants. Maybe one day you could also have a pair of uh, Zelda Breath of the Wild pants. I, I love them. <laughs> People are jealous. It's Christmas marathon. I'm a streamer. What did you think I was going to wear? Like a suit and tie? What are you, crazy? Zelda pants. Okay. So. Oh, oh God. It's vibrating. <laughs> it went crazy. I guess that means that it's syncing with the PC and it's working. All right. Zelda pants. Ants in your Zelda pants. Oh my God. It's vibrating again. Stop that. Stop vibrating. <laughs> what is going on? Hello, King Michael. Good to see you as well. Okay. Okay, um... Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba, screwed over here. Zoop. Here we are. Timbo Slice is cheered again. He says, screw the haters. I love the pants. It's working from home. I talk to clients on the, in, on the pone in my undies. No one can see. On the pone in your undies. I don't want to know what the pone is. I think you meant to say phone, but... On the pone. Um... All right. So... I'm going to forewarn everyone. Usually when I boot a PC game, it's insanely loud for no fucking reason. So I'm going to boot the game right now. It's probably going to be insanely loud for no fucking reason. You guys ready? Just forewarning all of you. I had this working yesterday. That means nothing. Every time I play a PC game, it might work. And then I go to, to, to update it. And it doesn't work. You know, or the next day, everything's working. I go to do it. Oh, it doesn't want to work. So we'll see what happens here. By the way, we're at 1,010 subscribers. So I will update that right now. Thank you for the support today, everyone. Now I'm trying to... Dude, I'm serious. I'm trying to boot the game and Steam is updating. Merry Christmas, Sambuka. Good to see you, man. I hear the landscapers outside. You hear that? Thank you, Derek. It's good to see you as well. Okay, the game is booting. Let's fix that. You guys don't look down. Is it still not working? What the fuck? What is this? I'm getting a hundred pop-ups even though know, I turned all that shit off. Stupid shit going on. Still too loud, right? Blaringly loud? Why? I turned it down. Alright, hold on. Oh, here's why. I got it. There we go. Nintendo nerd. He's the angry Atari Sega nerd. He's the angry video game nerd. There you go. Okay. No, I actually gotta get it captured. That's better, right? That's better volume. If he plays the shitty games that suck ass, I don't know if you guys knew that. This is a, this is a throwback for me because I used to fucking watch all his stuff, and I haven't watched it in a million years. Okay, let's actually get this capturing now. There we go. So. Tommy Sega Nerd. Angry Video Game Nerd. There it is. Only it's two, it's in front of everything, so hold on. There we go. La, 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 la. Now the landscaper. They're getting louder. Fuck. It sucks. I want to hear the music. See, they're still too loud or I'm coming in too soft. All right, fair enough. I can I can adjust it. No worries. Here we go. That better? Let's get a perfect volume before we actually start playing, shall we? How does that sound now? Merry Christmas to you, King Michael. How much did this cost? This is only t like $12 on PC and it's $15 on the Switch. <clears throat> 
Now it's too quiet. <clears throat> yes, this is the remastered version. That's why it says deluxe. All right, I'll up it a little bit. All right, there we go. Let's just roll with this, okay? You guys ready? Let's roll with it. Now hold on, because I want to be able to see your chat. Okay, now I have to put back on the game. There we go. All right, here we go. <clears throat> Options, sound, okay, here we go. La 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 la. This is such a throwback for me. <clears throat> New game. Oh my god, dude, do you think they <laughs> Do you think they have enough settings? Shout out to Bones NYC who just subscribed to the channel. Take a look at all this. Easy, ain't got time for this shit, no problem. Extra hit points, enemies are weaker, go nuts. Normal. Challenging as the asshole developers intended. Old school for hardcore fucking nerds. Limited tries, strong enemies, original death blocks. Only 10 lives, 2 hit points, extra strong. 5 lives, 2 hit points, super strong enemies, no checkpoints. 1 hit, 1 life, no saving progress. YOLO! You die, you start over. How far can you get? Oh my god. I'm doing normal. So it's the original and the sequel. And if you beat both games, there's apparently something different. Well, we're gonna go with the original. Angry video game nerd and his friends were playing a shitty video game together when suddenly... The fuck were they playing Granddad? His friends were zapped into the TV. The nerd managed to escape, but... An arm came out of his TV, grabbed him by the balls, and pulled him in. <laughs> game land, 3 a.m. Don't you hate it when an arm comes out of your TV and grabs you by the fucking balls? That's the worst. Uh, Alright, what the shitty... Okay, so we got jump. Jump is A. Wow, it's floaty. It's a floaty jump. X is fire. He charge. No, just regular bullets. B. B does nothing. Y does nothing. Triggers do. Oh wait. No, triggers don't do anything. Oh wait, one of them does. Oh, omnidirectional aiming. That's neat. So if you hold right trigger and you move around, now you can shoot in eight directions. Maybe seven directions. No, you can shut down. Okay, that's cool. So that prevents you from accidentally moving if you're trying to shoot straight. This reminds me of Mega Man, but it reminds me of something else too, like uh, like Earthworm Jim, actually. Uh, Ruby Atomic Chase said, where's the Dark Side Phil game? I don't know, maybe there will be one one day, maybe there won't be. AVGN will always be more popular than I am. Hey, listen, I'm Nagy. Oh no, fuck, go away. Nagy. I killed it! Fuck tutorials, you wanna hold my hand to the game? I'm the fucking nerd. Wow, I killed the tutorial. Supposed to be Navi, obviously. Oh, you give him his middle finger. I killed Navi from fucking Zelda already. Very nice. Put the cam on the bottom left. People are already requesting I move the camera. Okay, hold on. Poor Navi. I like how they call it Naggy. I want to put it here so I don't block the text, though. There's going to be text for the subtitles. Okay. All right. Uh, death count. Okay. Oh, nope, no, I can't see the chat. God damn it. Now hold on. It's got a tip. Just wanted to make sure it's real. I think it is. I did. I received a tip from SPB Original. It took me $4.20 and I love this game. Thank you, Phil. You're welcome. Something different for sure. I'm glad someone nominated it. It's something cool I've never played. Again, I used to be a super fan. Of the angry video game nerd for the like like i said 2006 to 2009 i saw every video he ever put out i loved all his content i actually owned a whole season of his stuff on dvd and when i started making content in around 2009 2010 i stopped watching all his stuff it just happens you know she will cheer to say i didn't know talking about covid was only a 10 minute timeout so we're not talking about covid today it's a christmas marathon sparring king cheers derek says oj and rambo interviewed avgn at too many games yes they did remember I don't remember it. I think I watched it once. That looks like the Fireball on Super Mario World. Actually, Super Mario 3. What is this? Checkpoint. Okay. You got past the one thing, checkpoint. A beer? I wonder if a beer, does beer recover your health, possibly? I see three 
They look, look at me like bootleg rolling rock bottles at the bottom, upper left hand corner of the screen. Maybe that's your health. All right. Oh god, that's definitely a Mega Man enemy right there. Okay, sub weapons? Oh shit. He chucks. He chucked a ball. That was the sub weapon. Yep, that's hell. What's this? A barrel? Now I have a new a new sub weapon, a barrel. I don't know what that does. I like the animations when the things explode. What's that? Fucking shit! And now look who's back! Nagy is back! Use the kicker we really helped completely. I see. Stupid Nagy. Ow. Skulls mean instant death, steer well clear of the block. Fuck, I hope there aren't too many of those around. Only a really shitty developer would do that. Right. This is another power-up. Use it with... Shut the fuck up! Okay. Doesn't shut up. wonder what this does, this power-up. Weird green thing. I need that beer. I don't know what the hell these power-ups are. What is this one? What the fuck was that? Hey, listen, watch out for it. Shut up! I don't need you! Oh, here we go. Eight-way shooting. That's what the eight-way shooting's for, right there. Beautiful. Anything up here? I wonder what this does. Looks like it transforms you into like that Terminator. Blue4-2188. Resubscribed for 37 months. Thank you, Blue4. An actual brother resubscribed for 7 months. A Merry Christmas, Phil. Merry Christmas to you. How much you want to put the angry video game where like, like, it's a lot of money off of this? I bet a bunch of people bought this game. They probably made a ton of money. Oh, good thing I hit the checkpoint. Uh-oh. Excuse me. Derek says, do I remember my favorite episode of Angry Video Game Nerd? Uh, yeah, I would say it was the, uh, either the Spider-Man episode or the Bugs Bunny birthday blowout episode where he beats the fuck out of Bugs Bunny and takes a liquid shit on his face. Or, I'm kidding, I'm not kidding. Or the Christmas episode where it was when he was a screw attack and it featured all the people from screw attack as the ghosts of Christmas past, present, and future. It was really neat. All right, let's have some more of this old Scrooge. Okay, um, let's see here. Wow, there's a lot of stages. Assholevania? Thy farts consume. Dungeons and dickholes. Happy fun candy time. Future fuckballs 20, 2010. Beat it and eat it. Boo haunted house and blizzard of balls. Well, you know, being that it is the holidays and it's two days till Christmas, I think we're going to do blizzard of balls. That sounds good. Oh shit. Immediately get fucking hit. Oh, you can crouch? I didn't even know. I didn't even try that yet. All right, these are definitely Mega Man enemies. These are 100% stolen from Mega Man. All right, I totally like that he has um the, the Nintendo Zapper. That's really neat. He's wearing the Power Glove, but I like that he's using the Nintendo Zapper as his gun. Ass. Ew, ass written in piss. All right, just 1 million percent feels like a Mega Man game, which is cool. I'm not complaining. I like Mega Man. <laughs> The head just goes, just goes, sucks into the ground. Not even like a death animation. Like, oh God, I killed Rudolph. Well, so much for Christmas Eve and delivering those presents, man. He's dead. That's okay. There's a bunch of uh, apparently Rudolph clones here. Checkpoint. Oh, he's shooting shit. Rudolph is shooting duty out of his butt. Holy crap. Boo Haunted House is a quote from the Nightmare on Elf Street episode. You're right. I remember that. What happened? Uh oh. My controller desynced. There we go. My controller is desyncing. I knew there would be problems playing on PC. I fucking knew it. Oh god, I took damage there. Oh god. 
Oh no! I hit the checkpoint. Oh! <laughs> I got to the checkpoint immediately got owned. Fuck, it's fucking snowballs. God damn it! Oh shit! The birds are taking dumps. The snowballs are rolling in my face. What's going on? Go back and get that beer now. There we go. Fuck that. It didn't respawn the enemy, unlike Mega Man, where the enemy would have totally showed up again. Rolling Rock. What's hilarious is he only had Rolling Rock in like one or two episodes. And then he immediately swapped it out for the local brew because he wanted to support local breweries. Yet, like, somehow it became synonymous with his content, the Rolling Rock, he didn't really drink it that much in the show. This is so Mega Man, you fucker! Oh shit, sliding! What are those? I don't know what that was. I can't get by here. I gotta go back down. Oh, James. You're so brave, James. To fight all these hideous creatures. If only I were so brave. I could never fight Rudolph. He's shooting duty at me. Shit. Whoa. I'm not touching that. Oh, I thought I could make it through. The answer was no. Could not make it through. Stop shooting duty. Come on, man. Look at the Rudolph. He's fucking taking a... He's bringing scat fetish Rudolph, man. Rudolph eat too many bean burritos or some shit. Oh, my God. Rudolph is kicking my ass. Okay. Oh yeah, people are saying EVGN has become crappy. I don't know. I, like I said, I really have not watched his content in like 10 years. I'm not even exaggerating there. I was a super fan of his early stuff, and after that, I started becoming... I was a content creator myself. When I became a content creator, I basically just stopped watching everyone's stuff because I was so busy making my own and getting immersed in my own community and everything, right? I, I didn't really have time to, to bother with other people's content anymore. I wonder what that cartridge is. Likely that cartridge is a secret, right? You probably have to go up there somehow and get it, but I can't get it from here, it doesn't look like. I think I would have taken the high area, the highway to get that. Oh, oh, oh shit. Oh my god. Expand Dunks, unlike you, he stopped being an independent. He joined a media conglomerate who now writes his episodes and he no longer even plays the games. His friend's motherfucker Mike will be leaving the channel next year to focus on Twitch. Really? So you're basically saying he's completely scripted now. So it's nothing like his old stuff. I see what you're saying. People obviously would be very upset about that. So the people who are fans of the original content. In fact, it was always him doing it. Him and his friend. It was always him and his, and his friend. Yeah, look at that. N-E-R-D. The four, four cartridges. N-E-R-D. I get it. You gotta collect all four, right? I can never really understand why people would not like that. You know, again, I only watched... Uh, I only watched the nerd stuff way back when. So we're talking over 10 years ago, right? I haven't seen anything that would be considered a new angry video game there. There's the, okay, I got the R. Oh, I missed the N. Where the hell was the N cartridge then? Oh, look at this. Getting it. Oh, whoa, whoa! I got owned. Ripley Atomic says, of course, the, nerd, the, the trolls are trying to create an angry video game. Here. 
Now the nerd, the nerd was the originator. Like for me, like I really feel like he was a, ri a real originator of content. You know what I mean? Um, other people may be like, oh, you know. What's funny is when I first started, I'm not kidding. Everyone on YouTube who was like, who was a hater, was like, oh, you're copying the angry video game nerd. I was like, what? Like I do full playthroughs of games with improv commentary. He does scripted review shows with comedy aspect. Like, what on earth are you? How could you even compare the two? Oh, look at this, Santa. You grip a little shit. You play about every game you get. This is for... Oh, my God. I killed Santa Claus. I killed him. I got an achievement, too. Oh, my God. I'm running Santa's body. Oh, come on now. This is a little excessive for the holidays, don't you think? I killed him. I killed Santa. Santa, baby, how do you like me riding your corpse down the hill? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my, this is... Oh, fuck. How the fuck am I ever gonna survive this? Alright, it's not working out. What the fuck kind of view is that? <laughs> fuck. Okay, I got past that part. Oh, it's too fast for my old man reflexes. Fuck! My controller keeps desyncing. What is it? This is the wire, the same wire I've used on Xbox One for like five, six years, it's, it's like a super loose wire. <laughs> so it desyncs a lot. There. Whoa, spirits, you did not heed our Christmas warnings, there. How you suffer the festive consequences. Oh my God. The spirits, the three spirits of Christmas. Noble's Cheery say, hope you've been having fun so far. What drinks did you get? Uh, five different beers. Currently, I'm drinking Old Scrooge from a Washington brewery. But I have many other beers, plus I have other stuff. So, Yeah, I didn't get the end. Shit. I wonder what you get if you get all the cartridges. All right, Turtle Dude. Thanks for stopping by. Hopefully, I'll see you later. Yes, Derek. Angry Video Game Nerd, I believe he began in 2006. I began in 2008. After being inspired by him. So. <laughs> okay. Alright. We just keep track of time right now. It's just past one. Okay. Alright. Uh, what should I do next? How about future fuckballs? <laughs> yeah. They look just like Metroid. Are you kidding me? Sure, this is what 2010 was like. Cute green blocks and purple jellyfish. This is what my 2010 was like. I don't know about you guys. 2010 was the year I got laid off from my job and I started doing YouTube full time. Let's get <laughs> Okay then. How does the game look to you guys? Is it running at 60 frames? Oh. Yeah, that was Rob the Robot. He did an episode that had Rob the Robot in it, so I'm not surprised to see Rob the Robot in this. The music is awesome, I agree. I love the old school 8-bit music. Like 
I think this ability freezes all the enemies on the screen. Cool. I timed it right. There's the end. Oh god, that's gonna be hard to get. <laughs> Shit. Your fuck balls. Why on earth did I do that? Oh my god, I'm stupid. Wow. Tommy Chu said, hey, Laser Lips, your mama was a snow blower. That sounds familiar to me, but I don't know what that's from. This game's from 2013, huh? It's pretty crazy. This was when I was a full-time content creator for, for about two to three years. And, uh... And I knew the game had come out. And I think a, a few people had asked me to play, but... No one really, I think at that point, I was still popular enough that people were like just into my stuff and they didn't really care to see me play other people's games and shit, you know? Oh my god. Holy crap, that was close. I'm gonna die a million times. Oh, my controller just desynced. And now resynced. <laughs> A mess. Oh my god. I want to see if there's anything over there, and there wasn't. Okay. Checkpoint. Thank god. Progress. These are totally the insta-kill beams from Mega Man, by the way. Straight out of Mega Man. It would be cool if someone, if, if like, you could walk on those later or something, right? Moon Walkman just sent me $5, said, How are you? Merry Christmas. Wish you the best and Happy New Year. It is updated. I wonder if you, if, how, what? He said, what do you call your wife? I call her whatever I want. Because I love her. And she loves me. And it's none of your old beeswax. <laughs> All right, let's update this. Here's the land. I think those are landscapers outside. <sighs> All right, here we go. Thank you for the tip. Mm, uh oh, desync again. Okay. <clears throat> Bum, 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 bum. Okay, checkpoint. Good. Oh god, it totally is a disappearing rear putting box from Mega Man. Here they are. They make the same sound effect now. <laughs> yeah, does these fucking things, nerd timings and everything. Oh, this level is an asshole. Alright. 
boom, boom, boom. Did I like the TV though saved by the bell? I never really actively watched it. Oh, I see. Let's see what I gotta do. Uh, excuse me. Kill blocks are fucking annoying. I don't know what that is, a Terminator? I don't know what it does. Look at this thing. Oh my god. Wait, you can't fall here? You can't touch those killer blocks. Alright. Why would I want to go? Maybe there's a reason. Is there anything down there? I don't know. I don't want to chance it. Checkpoint here, so I don't want to chance it. Checkpoint, nice. All right, I guess now I can chance it, right? Oh, look at this! What the hell? What the fuck? Future nerd. There's no time to explain. I'm you from the future. Are you shitting me? Shut the fuck up and listen. You're stuck inside a shitty game. No shit, how do I get the fuck out of here? Future Nerd says, you don't understand, it gets worse. This is only the first time there's a sequel. What? This isn't even the original. Right now you're in a shitty remastered collection. So this is, this probably wasn't in the original. This is because they remastered it. They didn't. They did. They polished that turret and sold it all over again. Remastered, more like remasters? Fuck this bullshit. <laughs> Thanks to a glitch, I was able to bring this back in time for the sequel. A spread shot for silver surfboard section above. Silver surfboard? I said too much. What an asshole. Handsome, but an asshole. So, if you are not aware, I think he's referring Silver Surfer, which is one of the earliest games that the nerd actually played. And it's super hard game for the NES. And it's really ridiculously over, but just broken game. So, I'm curious that they give me the spread shot here. Does that mean that they actually thought this part of the game was so hard? They wanted to make it easier for people who played this game years later? Maybe, right? Maybe. You know, this game has a lot of dirty potty mouth. I'm very upset by that. This game would be more PG rated. We all know that the nerds are very family friendly. <laughs> here it is. Oh, God. Here it is. Merry Christmas, Madara. Good to see you. Oh, man. Look at this. I hear a landscaper outside, so it's probably gonna get loud in a second. Oh, I ran out? Oh, I got hit. I knew when you get hit, you lose it. Oh, man. At least I got some health back. Oh, you can move forward and back just like Silver Surfer. This is, they, dude, they totally made this like Silver Surfer on the NES. I never played it, but, you know, oh, what? Oh, I'm not gonna tell what those look like. I never, <laughs> I never played it, but I saw the, the video on it a million times. It's like someone has a chainsaw outside. <laughs> What's that? Checkpoint? Oh my god. Where did you learn to fly? Don't waste the booze. Well, I die. <laughs> this? Nothing up there? What is this secret for doing that? Oh wait, I need the- I don't think I need the keg. I don't know what the keg does. I think this isn't even full health, but I already have to. Oh my god. I just got destroyed. By the way, I don't know where the final cartridge is. Not there. <laughs> Okay, say so okay, that's what you do. You're about to die, you use the kick to get your health back. Now I understand. Now, see? My children, now you will learn to die. God. Where'd you learn to be an asshole? <laughs> 
Very nice. La la la. I get a, a tiny bit of a buzz from this beer. Just a tiny bit. Okay. Looks like another tip. Let's let's double check it though. Let's see. Landscapers are chopping shit down. All right, I got a $5 tip from Leave a Dream, which is my dog recently had to be put down your streams to help take my mind off of it, so thanks. I'm really sorry to hear that. And uh, I wish that this landscaper wasn't so loud outside my window right now. It's very inappropriate for me to say I'm very sorry to hear about your loss. What the hell? <laughs> wow. Okay, then. I missed, Now I missed the D cartridge. Uh, how about Assholevania? Let's do some Assholevania. What a horrible night to have a curse. The curse of being stuck in this shitty game. So obviously this is supposed to be Castlevania, right? Duh. The music even sounds like Castlevania, which is sweet. Oh, I almost walked right into that. I got hit? Really? Oh, no. Yeah, dude, it's, it's a total knockoff of Castlevania. Oh, shit, I walked right into it. Is there a Christmas massacre in my neighborhood after you walk in? Yes. That's, that's the night Santa went crazy. The night Saint Nick went insane. Must have realized he's getting the wrong deal, so he finally must have snapped at his brain. There we go. That's what got Whoa, did you see that glitch? Look at that. The, it's the Castlevania screen shit. Got it. Oh, there's totally an item over there. You saw it, right? How do I get over there, though? There's no double jump, right? There's a hidden item over there, but I don't have a double jump, so I don't know how I can reach it. Yeah, see? I have no idea how I reach it. There's an item right there. Maybe you gotta jump from this screen? Yes! No! Oh! Anonymous says there's characters you can unlock, but I haven't unlocked them yet. I see. And then you can do a double jump from the bottom. Vroom, vroom! Let's chop some heads! Do it! Decapitate! Oh god, it's the moon from Majora's Mask! The moon from Majora's Mask! What the hell? That's creepy, dude. La, la, la. Right, right, even if you're wow, even if you take a hit and you step on the instant deadlock, you still die. Even if you're blinking, I mean you should be invincible. You still die. Can I jump over this? No. <laughs> no. You just die. Now wait a minute. There we go. Oh, it's close. Room, room. Oh yeah, a little off the top, bro. There's the D cartridge. I 
got them all. I don't know what it does when you get them all, but I got them all. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, now I gotta do it again. The Lord of the Harvest, bring it down. Bring it Super Scope. Super Scope 6? That's nah, a Super Scope shit. Oh, I'm done with it already. Wow, it seems we're now real fast. The power of just, just expires so quickly. Checkpoint. Boss time? Seems like it. What the hell is that? It's Frankenstein. How do I hit him? What the hell? No, it's Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Are you shitting me? Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Fucking Hyde, dude. That's awesome, actually. Oh. Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. game over the landscaper, I applaud you. There we go. This is a fun game. I like this game a lot, actually. Alright, a few more shoutouts. Crazy Spanks, Jason, you're gonna try your Guilty Gear Strive when it comes out on PS5. Number one, I don't know when it comes out. Number two, I don't know if you will be interested in seeing me play it. It's all up to you guys, really. Alright? Go to Hanson to me, $1.50. Did so you ever watch Irate Gamer? People hate him because he ripped off AVGN. I never watched him actively. I only learned of him when I found out that people hated him because he said he ripped off AVGN. Um... Interestingly enough, he did do original content, but he found most of his success when he copied AVGN. He actually did two or three episodes directly stolen from AVGN. Um, I don't know if he ever publicly admitted it, but he absolutely definitely did. Like, you could just, by watching the stuff, you can tell he 100% stole. Um, but apparently later on, I guess they reconciled or whatever, right? Like, they, he didn't really care about it. Uh, Serpent of Eve Cherry said... Is it true Brunel Enterprise will invest money in CD Projekt Red? No. King Michael to the dollars. Will I watch any Christmas movies on Christmas? Likely, yes. Likely, we'll be watching, like, Muppet Christmas Carol. Maybe, like, The Grinch. Maybe Home Alone. We'll see. Jose Martinez, Cheers. How are you doing today? Hope you and your family are a wonderful Christmas. Thank you very much, Jose. That's a very nice thing to say. Okay. Let's continue. I actually really like this game. Uh, Thy Farts Consume. That sounds good. Let's suck some parts. Oh, fuck. That flaming skull is also straight out of Mega Man. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh! Oh, oh. God damn it! to have this loud of a noise in the background. Oh, what the? I walked right into it. Going. Seems like my condo association scheduled everything for today. Seriously. 
It's like they had the, the alarm inspection. They had guys chopping down trees outside. <laughs> they got everything going on in the same day. Okay. It's over here. No secret room. Well, fuck you. Oh, no! You got me joking me! Oh! I was right there at the checkpoint. Son of a bitch. I freaking owned. I got owned. God damn it. Unlike Mega Man, when you press jump on the ladder, you just go up. Which is weird. In Mega Man, you drop. A small change. A small difference. This is a pretty crazy level. I don't know anything about parts in this level. This is a fucking flame and death. No, nothing, nothing in these doors. <clears throat> or openings to the left. Nope, they're all just tricks. Oh, it's vroom vroom, motherfucker. Vroom vroom. No, I touched it. Oh, no. Oh, man. Oh my god, oh. I'm sorry Derek, I'd read your message, but I can't, I can't hear it. I can't hear your message. <laughs> what the hell? I can't read when it's so loud. Come on, you fucker. Oh. I need more beer. <laughs> no, this is not on... Sony or on Xbox for some reason. It's only on Steam and fucking Nintendo. This collection is on Switch and on Steam, and that's it. You can't get it on, on like any other console. It's so odd. Because I wanted to get it on another console, and it's not there. Very confusing. Oh, God. Be careful here. Alright, at least I got to a checkpoint. Oh, my God. It's Jaws. Fucking Jaws, dude. Ride Jaws. What the fuck is going on? Okay then, look at this. <laughs> okay then, yeah. Oh, he jumps with you. I didn't know, oh God. Oh no, a game bug. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. A game bug, guys, no way. Oh. Of course, I have to get the game bug in the remastered edition. Oh, man. I had to quit out of the stage. And now I gotta do the whole thing over again at some point. I'm not doing it now. Uh, I can't believe it. Game bug, dude. An un unsolvable game bug. Just my freaking luck. Just my freaking luck, man. Is this maybe Little Nemo? 
If I remember correctly, the game Little Nemo the Dream Master had a bunch of uh, bouncy mushrooms like this. I think that's what this is based off of. I got a key. There we go. I'm going up. Pretzel, you as well. He said, hope you have an awesome Christmas. I hope everyone has an awesome Christmas. This is a tough year for everyone, guys. To be honest here, right? It's a tough year for everyone everything going on in the world and i hope that all of you have a good christmas in your own way because i don't know what the hell everyone's going to be doing this year obviously, obviously everyone's going to be having a very different christmas than usual even me like i'd be going out with, with, with my wife and doing christmas shopping and, and festive stuff we haven't done damn in anything we can't because of the freaking coronavirus man so i hope everyone's going to have a good one somehow you got to make it work right but that's life. We persevere. We face adversity and we persevere, right? We don't let it beat us. Yeah. Oh, I inadvertently fell on a checkpoint. This is just like Mega Man. It's exactly like Mega Man. Oh shit, I know there's spikes there. Yep. Yeah. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, uh, let's see here. Gold Noble said cheers to take a shot of eggnog. Oh, I don't have the eggnog yet. We're only doing beer for now. We're gonna do eggnog later, trust me. I'm, I'm feeling a little bit of a buzz from this beer because it is a stronger alcohol beer. quite a big bottle. It's really a double bottle. So. It's good, though. I haven't had beer in a long time. This is tasty. That was stupid. Why'd I do that? Find a key. Whoa, that was a good one. I inadvertently did that. <laughs> the first shot. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I didn't know that was going to break. I can't pass here yet. Uh, I was like, why can't I go down? Kill him on the left. Checkpoint and a key. Let's see what's the other way. Oh, it's the R cartridge. Sweet. Bum, 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 bum. I like the fantasy team. Oh crap. What happened? Why did I take damage? Oh, I gotta run. Is there a way to run faster? You have a great Christmas too. He's going to be spending it with his uh, so you can see Eve tomorrow with his relatives at their home. Uh, excuse me. You know that's one of the reasons why I'm not doing full streaming tomorrow at all. It wouldn't make sense because I, I realize Christmas Eve is when a lot of people are going to probably be spending time with their relatives. <laughs> with their immediate relatives and you know how on earth are you? how am I supposed to get that? Wait a minute. Oh shit, this is... I don't know how to do this. 
Avengers wait. Oh god. Ah! Oh. Oh my god, again. That's how you get it. Beautiful. Oh boy, I almost died. <laughs> almost died again. Checkpoint, I got all the cards. This is a game I could be playing and get all the cartridges. Seriously, it's fun. I'd replay this game a bunch of times to get the cartridges. I'm the Lord of the Harvest. Did I lose it? I did, I used to lose it kind. Look at those, oh my god, look at all the bloody pieces rolling. Ugh. <laughs> That's funny. Eat it gore. Oh, what is that now? I guess it's like Silver Surf. I have three kegs, so if there's a boss fight, I'll be in good shape. I just gotta get to it and not die. I wonder if I can beat beat this game today. I don't know. I don't know because I have to review that fucking hell segment. It's really annoying. Oh, there's definitely a boss. Dude, this is a boss from a game that I played. This is totally a boss from a real game. I stubbed his head off. Ugh. Squirts blood. There you go. Technical 27, you just reset for three months. A Merry Christmas, Phil. Merry Christmas to you, Technical. Good to see ya. Oh, man. I beat four of the stages. It's pretty good. Do you guys want me to keep going, or are you guys bored already? Because it's really up to you guys. Um, I, I'm, I'm liking the game. I keep playing it. But I definitely don't want you guys to get bored or anything. I hope you guys are enjoying it. I've been playing it now for roughly an hour or so. Seems like half and half. Half people are laying and half people want me to switch. Alright, how about one more? We'll do one. Oh, God. Controller desynced again. Nose Vacuum Cheer said, Do you remember when people called you the king of retro? No, no one ever did. Let's do. Oh, shit, desynced. We'll do one more stage. We'll do one more stage, then we'll, then we'll switch it up, okay? Remember, keep on, next is going to be Minecraft, so... Oh, uh, let's do Boo Haunted House. Maybe this will have horror theme to it. Oh, no. I can't see. This would have been good for the Halloween marathon. Shit. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, my God. All right, I'm... Sucking the balls. Sucking the balls. Sucking the balls. No! Alright, let me just check one. There is a witch. <laughs> there is a witch on a broom. <laughs> oh, oh my god, a pumpkin now. What? Okay, I guess I got hit. Kill the pumpkin, I can't kill the ghost. I mean, it's true, you can't really kill the ghost. Oh god! How do you kill a ghost that's already dead? And in cartridge. Come on, give me a check. Good and the bad guy with Oh, I'm the guy with the gun. Good and bad, I'm the guy with the gun. That's right. Give me a checkpoint, you fucker! No, you fuckhead! Come on, give me a checkpoint. Yes, thank you. The game listens to me. It's always nice when the game listens to you. Directly. Now this, oh god. This reminds me of Super Mario World. The sneaking blocks that you would have to follow. <clears throat> it's funny because I'm only playing this seven years too late for me to be giving, like, insightful commentary on it, right? I should have played it when it was new. I don't know why I did I don't know, I was stupid back then. You know, seven years ago, I was like, oh, 
the angry video game theory game. Well, he's a content creator. I don't want to play anything from any other content creator, right? <clears throat> Even though he didn't make the game or anything, he made money on it. Though. I'm sure he, I'm sure he makes money off of every sale, right? Which is cool. That's gotta be. There's gotta be a uh, some pretty big residuals for every sale in this game. Like I, twelve bucks to buy this collection. He probably got like fifty cents. <laughs> Sadly, sadly, that's probably what he actually made. He probably made like 50 cents. That's a bummer. If, if James doesn't actually write his own episodes and do it anymore, that's kind of a bummer. That he just does scripted content. And okay, let me shake that back. It's a bummer he does scripted content he doesn't script. You know what I mean? Because he was always the indie guy who did his own thing and he didn't have a budget. And that's why it was cool that he could do what he did because it wasn't like he was corporate or anything. You could tell it was always him and his friends making the episodes. I hit a check once, sweet. So that's kind of a bummer if now he kind of like, he's doing only big budget shit for fucking scripted corporate shit, you know? Then again, like I said, I haven't seen AVGN in so effing long. I don't really know if there's a significant difference or not from the old content. If it's if it's still true to what he used to do, then I guess it's fine. You know what I mean? If it's the same vein of stuff, and, but if it's not, and if he like totally changed his content to sign off and make big money, I mean that kind of sucks. Then again, it's funny with guys like AVGN and guys, especially like a nostalgia critic, right? Where Nostalgia Critic outright said, I don't want to do Nostalgia Critic anymore. Like, I want to do other content that's very different. And when he quit doing Nostalgia Critic, his fans backlashed against him. And said, We're, we refuse to watch your new content. All we want is Nostalgia Critic. And he was like, damn, so I'm, I'm literally stuck doing this forever. And he has been. Like, he can't stop doing it. No one will. I mean, not to say that his hardcore fans don't support his new efforts, but it's kind of messed up that he's like, I just don't want to do it. And people are like, well, oh well. You don't want to watch it, then. <laughs> like, damn. <clears throat> Isn't it also true of Angry Joe? That he was basically like, I would like to do like more more streaming and stuff like that. We were like, well, we really only care about your Angry Joe reviews, right? I don't know. Because, again, I haven't watched any of this stuff. This is me just speculating on, uh, you know, things you hear over the internet, but... I, I mean, I'm probably one of the few people who, uh, out of the stuff that I do, I rarely change. And when I do change, it's not. Even, I guess the biggest change I ever did was going full on full full time streamer versus YouTuber. And now I interact with you guys every day and I talk to you directly. But outside of that, like, honestly, what's changed in my content, right? Like, I'm still doing what I love to do. There's the R. Alright, I just gotta go back. And yeah, some people would argue, I guess I got watered down too. Like, remember, I used to be over the top with the amount of swearing I used to do, the sexual references. I, I hardly do that stuff anymore, right? So, honestly, I'm glad that I did change for the better. I do feel that, like, a lot of my old stuff was over the top because of things like AVGN. Like I saw AVGN swearing like a sailor in every video, you know what I mean? And I loved it. So to me, that was that was what's successful, right? I gotta cater to that. That's what people want. And now I realize, actually, I've been around long enough, that's not necessarily what people want. Right? That they like just seeing the real me and hanging out with the real me uh, over me being just a stupidly over the top, you know, crazy, which is what I used to be. Oh shit, well I got a check, so that's good. I got all four cartridges now. Blue Haunted House, oh, spot. <laughs> Son of a bitch! Oh, I thought I was out of the range of the ghost. Nope. 
Nope. Whoa! Okay, um... Cashmere Ghost says you have a family now. It's different. I mean, it is different. It absolutely is different. But was uh, when I started all this, I didn't take it seriously. I didn't care if people got angry at me. You know, like now I do because number one, I'm just tired of people being so nasty to myself and my family members over nothing. You know, like what the hell do I do to warrant this? What did my family ever do to warrant some of the hate I get? And fuck. And I, I like doing what I do. I love it. And it's such a trade-off that I get to do something amazingly positive and fun, but I gotta put up with so much negativity, so much hate for nothing. And my wife in particular, I don't want her ever getting attacked and stuff or shit that I do on the stream. What the hell did she do? Nothing. She never did a damn thing. And these people are so fucked in the head that they think it's okay to attack innocents. You know what I mean? Like, it's just nuts, because, you know, again, normal people don't think that way. Normal people will look at that and be like, are you out of your mind? Like, why would you do that? <clears throat> but, yeah, when I started all this, the thing is, when I started all this, I didn't know anything would ever be popular. I didn't know that anyone would care about things I said and did. I thought it was all a joke. I was like, why on earth would anyone care about what some random guy says on the internet about a game or a game studio or whatever? I'm some fucking nobody. I never thought I would be anyone. When I started this, I never thought I would I would make a living doing it. You know? Like, I never thought I'd make a dollar doing it. Like, who fucking pay me to do that? You know? Oh, Bimmy! You mean, like, Bimmy and Jimmy? The Double Dragons? Oh, God! Why'd they... What the fuck? It's supposed to be Jason's coming. Let's get him, Jason. So it's Bimmy and Jimmy, the Double Dragons. Get it? Only here it looks like it's the boss from Contra with Jason. There. Cool. Oh, I died instantly. Huh. Fuck. Jason and Freddy Krueger? I mean, this is what it's supposed to be. I think Jason and Freddy Krueger, but they're calling them Vinny and Jimmy, which is the joke about Double Dragon. Oh, I didn't know you could jump over the balls. Fuck! You touch the chainsaw, you die instantly. Instant death on the chainsaw! What's the point of having health bars if you die instantly? From, from fucking ABG and himself. That's from, uh, the Dragon's Quest. Oh, I killed him! Jimmy, no! Got him. Woo! Pretty good game. I actually really enjoy this game. I seriously enjoy it. Old Book Cloud 7 just gifted us up to Sniper Disc. Congrats, Sniper Disc. <clears throat> Alright, well, we've played this now for almost an hour and a half. Well, actually, about an hour because it took me about 15 minutes to set up. Hope you guys are liking it. It's fun, right? I like the game. And it is, there's even a sequel that I bought. So if you guys wanted to. <clears throat> if you guys ever wanted to see me uh, continue playing it, I would consider it. But I think people have seen enough of this. An hour of it is pretty fun, but, you know, if you get tired, so. I'm almost done with this beer, actually. Two-thirds done with it. It's pretty good. Yeah, chill stream. Some people are saying we'd like to see this continued as a chill stream. Keep in mind, there's a sequel. So it's this and another game, too. Golden Nobles gifted us up to X God Blaze. Congratulations, X God Blaze. Thank you, Golden Nobles. And Sage Lazen just reached over six months at nice stream. Thank you, Sage. Okay. <clears throat> so, how about we uh, switch over now? Right? What do you guys think? Do you want me to keep going or do you want me to switch to Minecraft and chill in Minecraft for a bit? No, we're not doing Fall Guys. We're definitely doing Minecraft next. 
because I want to go to the console that I'm only going to use once and then switch to the PS5 where we can do it in any order once we hit PS5, okay? Excuse me. Big Papa Phil just sent me three dollars. I want to say Merry Christmas, which shall leave it the best for you and your family and during these holidays. Thank you very much, uh, Big Papa Phil. Appreciate that. All right. How do I, uh... I miss Golden Noble's cheer. He says, I'm going to play some Yakuza 7 while watching. This is my first Yakuza game. It's easily one of my favorites of the year. Definitely one of my favorite games of the year. Okay, let's quit out. Oh, God. I'm sure the same thing. <laughs> God damn it. All right, cool. One of eight shit pickles? That's what it says. Look, I got one of eight shit pickles. When did I get a shit pickle? I have no idea, but I got one, apparently. Okay, then. <laughs> Alright, that's it for that game. Cool. I don't even know how to close it. <laughs> how the hell do I close the game? I gotta use Task Manager to close it. <laughs> end task. <laughs> I didn't know how to end it. Alright, guys. Thanks. That was good. That was a good start. That was certainly a good start to the, to the marathon. That was a fun game. And having references to a lot of the stuff that we've done, well, that he's done, and I've referenced over the years. And uh, I, would, I would consider playing that again if you guys wanted to see me play the first one and finish it and even play the second one because I got the collection on PC. I would do it. It's kind of frustrating, admittedly, to get it working on PC and have to switch between shit and everything. But it is what it is. That's why I did that first. All right? All right. On to the next.